My motocross bike, I'm doing some testing with here. I'm um, going to do a quick dyno run. <clears throat> have this uh, partially charged, it's at about three quarters charge right now. have uh, 90 or 109 volts roughly in the charge. Um, just made some changes to the controller so it allows the current to get to the full uh, current limit. Let's see what we can get here in the dyno software. It's going to be a bit noisy because I have a, um, it's a chain drive and the buffer there, the, the chain guide is actually touching the chain the whole time. So I'm going to actually machine that down and try to make everything a little bit better in the near future here. But let's make, let's give this a run. Put some new wheel bearings in the wheel this weekend and try and balance the wheel a little better. Make all that a little smoother on the dyno there. Everything looks pretty clean there. Oh, I hit 39.6 horsepower and the motor torque, max motor torque is 50 foot pounds. Kind of expect it to be low because this is a four turn motor. So 39.6 horsepower there. The efficiency is up a bit. Um, we're getting there. <coughs> What's the voltage at at that spot? It's down to 89.4 volts. So yeah, once the once the batteries um, are fully charged, that'll probably stay up more around 100, and that'll make a big difference in the horsepower right at the top there. So <clears throat> it's all coming.